Hey, our friends, welcome back to another live draw along. Yes. What's my name? Rob. What's your name? Jack. <laughs> we hope you're excited. You're, you're going to follow along with us. But before we do that, what do we usually always do in our live streams? Uh, spotlight. Yeah, we <laughs> spotlight one of our awesome art friends. Now, in the last in the last live lesson, who did we draw? Frozone. Frozone. And Faye is our spotlight today. She drew Frozone. And what was the challenge? To draw him like ice skating on his ice that he makes and yeah. have him in the city. In the city. He's protecting the city. Yes. She did awesome. She did a really great job. I love that she filled the whole page. She she covered the whole page with the background and she colored it all. And I love that she added the ice in that little sled that he's yeah. skating on. She did a great job. And we also want to congratulate all of our awesome art friends that submitted uh, their drawings to the challenge because they all did a great job. It's it's always so difficult to pick yeah. somebody to spotlight because everybody does amazing. Yes. All right. We hope you guys are excited. You got your art supplies ready. You need a marker. Papers. Papers. Coloring. And something to color with. We're going to use colored pencils, but you guys can use whatever you want to color. We also want to give an, a huge shout out to all of our art friends that are participating in, in our live li stream. Yes, in our live chat. Chat. Yeah. We're going to try to keep an eye on it so that we can answer a lot of your questions and also give you some shout outs too. During the lesson, it's a little difficult, but during the coloring part, we're going to try to do more of it. Yes. Okay. You ready to get started, dude? Yeah. All right. We got our markers. <laughs> now we're using two sheets of paper also because we're using markers. We want to make sure that our marker doesn't soak through the one sheet and get onto the table. Now this lesson has a lot of details. That's why we're super excited about it, yeah. right? Okay, so let's first start by drawing uh, Raven's eyes. Oh, she got a donation. Did we? No way. How'd you notice? Did it uh, pop up? Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. It's from the great Minecraft and Roblox. And they said, hi. Hi. <laughs> Thank you so much for the donation. All right, let's draw his eyes. We're going to draw two. Uh, they look like footballs or leaf shapes. And we're going to draw them towards the top of our paper, but in the middle, so that we have room for his whole body. So we're going to draw them right here. We're going to draw like this, we're okay, gonna draw another one like this, or the so the top line and the bottom line, like a football. And then we're gonna do the same thing over here. We're gonna repeat the same steps. And I'm also trying to tip them so they look like the, he's angry, right? So the, yeah. the, the corners, the inside corners are down lower than the outside corners. Okay, now let's draw his hood, his awesome hood. We're gonna start on the outside of the eye. We're gonna come up to the middle and then back down on the other out on the outside of his other eye. Now, if we ever go too fast, our art friends can do what? Pause the video. Yeah, you guys can pause the video. There's a lot of details in this, so remember, if you need more time to finish a step, you can pause the video. All right, now we're going to start above here, and we're going to draw an S line. It's going to come down like this, back out, and then back in. So it comes in, then back out. Yeah, awesome. Then we're going to do the same thing over here. We're going to come back in, back out, and back in. S line. <laughs> we love it. Oh, oh did we just get another one from the great Minecraft and Roblox? Thank you so much. It's $2.79. Canadian dollars. That's awesome. They must be watching us from Canada. Yeah. That's way cool. A huge so shout out best. to uh, You're the Best. You're the Best. We think they're the yes. best. <laughs> now let's draw the bottom of his hood, we're gonna draw a curve that comes down and connects the left over to the right side. And then also up here, we're gonna make these details on the side a little thicker. He has these little notches in his hood. And we'll color those in black later. Oh, somebody said, this is my favorite Fortnite drawing. Is it? Wow, I lost it, where'd it go? Oh, there's so many comments. <laughs> my Mine looks like a potato. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now we're going to draw the top of this hood. So we're going to start on the outside of these little notches, and we're going to go up. We're going to go up like this, and then back down on the other side. Yeah. Good job. Now right here in the middle, let's draw a line that connects the top down to the bottom part. And then we're going to draw the outside of his hood. So we're going to come... We're going to, we're going to come right here on the corner. We're going to come in just a little bit, back out, and then in, right here down at the bottom. And do the same thing over here on this side. All right. You got the other side too? 
Yes. Randy Porter says, this is our first time. Thanks so much. Oh, that's so cool that Randy Porter is joining us for the first time. And uh, can you draw a soda can? Olivia Barry, Barry says, can we draw a soda can? That would be fun. Yeah. Draw a cute little soda can. Maybe we could even draw a funny face on it. Okay, now we're going to connect the bottom to finish his hood. Now, also up here at the top, he's got a little uh, hole in his hood. So we can draw an oval. Now he's going to look so much cooler once we finish coloring him. But let's keep going. We're, now we're going to draw his, he has a scarf that's around his neck. So we'll start out here. We're going to draw a line that comes down from his neck and in. And we'll do the same thing over here on this side. Down and in. All right, I'm trying to keep a good, I'm trying to keep an eye on the comments. It's so difficult doing the lesson and, <laughs> and talk to our friends live. But let's see, I'm trying to, there was another comment I wanted to call out. Pickle Player says, give me a shout out, please. <laughs> and Isabel Hunter says, I'm watching from Hawaii. Hawaii. I wish I was in Hawaii drawing right now. Yeah. She's lucky. Yes, you are. <laughs> let's draw the rest of the scarf. We're going to draw another curve that comes down like this. And then we're going to come down to a point. And we don't want to come too far down. We've got to make sure that we're saving room for his body down here. So then we're going to come back up on the other side and then back in. There's his scarf. All right, cool. Now we're going to draw. He's got these really cool. He's called Raven, right? Yeah. He's got these feathers coming out of him. I think he might be part Raven. Yes, probably. Probably. Okay. We're going to draw these the awesome feathers that come out to the side. So we're going to start down here on his scarf. We're going to draw a big feather that comes out. And then back in. And we can repeat that same step. Let's draw another feather on this side. Out and back in. They look like giant leaves. Giant leaves, yeah. He kind of looks like a scarecrow, doesn't he? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Now we're going to draw a, sm a smaller one right here coming out on the side. And then we can draw another one tucked in behind there. And then I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. We'll draw two more, le two more leaves or feathers coming out on this side. Okay, cool. Let's draw a couple more coming down. Aim, they're aimed down towards the ground. So one over here, I'm gonna draw another one on this side. And then if you want, I'm gonna add, I'm gonna add one more over here, just to make it look even cooler. <laughs> I'm watching from America, and Robin Sears says, may you give me a shout out? Have you watched Rampage? We haven't watched Rampage yet, but That's I want cool. to. Yeah, because I used to play that video game <laughs> a long time ago on the original Nintendo. <laughs> All right. Okay, let's draw his body. We're going to draw two lines. We're going to draw. This is for the top of his body. We're going to draw two lines coming in. I'm going to draw them short so that you have, you know, so that you have room for the rest of his body. Yeah, he's running out of room quickly. Yeah. And he's thick. Super wide. I like how wide he is. Now, it's okay that our drawings look different, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, now we're going to connect the bottom with a curve, make it round so it looks 3D. And then we're going to add two more lines right above it. So we're going to add another one and another one right above that. That's his belt. Draw Captain America from Civil War. That would be awesome. We have drawn Captain America, but we didn't draw the Civil War version, I don't think. I'm making a comic called Fortnite versus Jailbreak. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> <laughs> Have you watched Jurassic World? No, we haven't watched Jurassic World yet. Oh looks my so goodness. Good yeah, it does. It looks really good. Let's add a few, let's add some details to his belt. So let's add one more right above that one. And then I'm going to add two lines here for his belt buckle on the top. It's almost like he has two belts. Yes. And then another belt buckle below it. And then he's got these. They kind of look like uh, straps or belt loops. So I'm going to add two lines, four lines on this side, and then two lines down here. And we are going a little quicker because there's so, so many little yeah. features on his body. And we want to add all of them, as many as we can, so that he looks, he looks cooler the more that we add. Yes. <laughs> okay. So he's got this really cool strap. Watch this. We're going to start. Oh, actually, he's got these shoulder straps. Let's draw two shoulder straps, one on each side. And then we're going to draw this really cool strap that comes all the way across. And then we're going to draw a little line down and back. Look how long. That's a rectangle, a really long rectangle. Abigail AV says, I love you. And we love you too. And Kaylee says, I live in Virginia. She's drawing in Virginia. 
Jurassic World is great. I loved it and watched it. Uh, watched it in Harbor, Maine. That's from Lucas Clark. Okay, we got a good recommendation to go yeah. see Jurassic World. We need to go see it. All right, let's draw. Let's draw smaller straps now. If you can fit it in there, maybe you can't fit the top one, but add a bottom one. So I'm going to add a little rectangle below and a little rectangle above, and it's behind the handkerchief or the his neckerchief. What do you call this thing? Scarf. Handkerchief. handkerchief. Oh, scarf. scarf. <laughs> hmm. And then I'm going to add a line that goes in between or behind all of the straps. Is that cool? Oh yeah, right. Here. Yeah, all the right. way down. That these straps are kind of holding his jacket together. All right, now let's draw. He's got little feathers coming out of his belt. So we're going to draw one that comes out this side and then back in. Then let's add another one. It's a little smaller and then a really small one next to it. Now I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. We're going to repeat all those same steps. We'll draw a feather that comes out that's big or long. Draw another one. And I'm drawing them so they look overlap. They're overlapped. So one's behind the other one. And then we're gonna draw that little one. There we go. All right, now we're gonna draw his legs. It's, you're gonna get really creative on how to fit his legs in there, but it's gonna look awesome. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay, we're gonna draw. I'm gonna. <laughs> I'm gonna draw two lines, and look, they're coming out. So his top body is coming in, and the bottom part's coming down and out like that. And we want these to be equal on both sides. I love that you're leaving enough room for his feet. Now this part is where you're going to get really creative. He's going to look like he's doing the splits. We're going to start right here below the outside line. It's okay. He's going to look awesome. He's going <laughs> to, we're going to draw a big A shape. So it's going to come up and then back down. And look at this. That, yeah. <laughs> I love it. It looks it's really cool. Like he's doing the splits. Yeah. You know what? He's in a super stance. He's, yes. he's, he's ready to super stance is take somebody out. Yeah. Super, <laughs> super stance is the splits. <laughs> okay, oh, we're going to draw his, his boots. We're going to draw a sideways V on each side to connect the outside line. And mine kind of looks like he's doing the splits too, but that's okay. You know how football, yeah. play <laughs> football players, when they're getting ready to tackle somebody, their legs are far apart. They look like they're ready. So you don't, not, you can't knock them over. Yep, that's exactly he's what got he's doing. Power stance. Okay. Yes. <laughs> now on his feet, on his legs, we're going to draw... A line that comes down from behind the feathers and then back in. <laughs> hey, oh, check this out. We got a third donation from the Great Minecraft Roblox. They said, my third time donating, you should draw a goat. Okay, we're going to draw a goat for uh, the yes. Great Minecraft. Yeah. got to remember. A goat. A goat. Don't let me forget, okay? okay. All right. Okay, let's add the other side. We're going to add the little uh, line that comes down. He, it kind of looks like he's wearing, his jacket is long. And or it goes, wearing a cape. Yeah, it kind of looks like a cape. I think it's cape part of his for each leg. jacket. <laughs> I think it's part of his jacket. <laughs> All right, now let's draw his boots. So we're going to start right here on his knee, and we're going to draw an A shape, and then a line that connects to the inside of his leg. And we'll do the same thing on the other side. A shape, and then connect it to his leg. Here cool. 707 wants a shout out. And uh, Naya DC says, do you have any pets? We don't have any pets right now, huh? We have Olivia. <laughs> she's, not, she's not a pet. She's a human being. That's our baby. <laughs> but sometimes she she's... She acts like one sometimes. She, she acts like an animal sometimes. Animal. Yeah, because she's always screaming. <laughs> she's not our pet. <laughs> we have Olivia. She counts as a pet. <laughs> yeah, when she gets a little older, maybe we'll think we can... Handle a pet. Yeah, <laughs> <maybe. grown> <laughs> All right, let's draw his armor on his knees. I'm going to draw, uh, it kind of looks like an oval shape or raindrop shape. We'll do the same thing on the other side for his knees. And then let's add two lines down here on his ankles. And then let's add straps on his left leg. We're going to add two lines really close together. And then I'm going to add another one to another two lines right above it that are close together. <laughs> uh, Marco says more Marvel please and somebody says they got an A in art because one of your drawing tutorials that's from Harley221 Martin Gaming that's awesome Woo! congratulations on the A that a. feels good huh we helped him out okay let's get what's he missing what's Raven missing oh his hands his hands yeah let's start up here with his shoulders we're gonna draw I'm gonna draw a little uh, V 
it's behind his feathers on this side. And I'm going to draw, it kind of looks like a W. Look at that, W. He's got his sleeves over his shoulders are torn, and they look a lot like his feathers. Let's repeat that same W over here. Cool. Okay, now let's draw his arms. We're going to draw them coming out. Almost like a cowboy reaching for his guns that are in a holster. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay, now on, we're going to add more details too. So let's add his bicep. Here we go. We're going to draw a curve that comes in like this and then back out. Where his, where his elbow would be. Let's do the same thing over here. Curve for his bicep and then back out. Okay, now his hands, I noticed that his gloves look like talons, like yeah. raven talons. They look sharp. So let's draw a sharp. We got another donation. What? Okay, draw a sharp V that's curved for his thumb, and I'll check out the donation. This is from Erica Love the Little Club Reese. <laughs> $1.99, can you draw a realistic leopard gecko? Okay, I am going to write these down. We're, yeah. we're going to write those down so that we can. That would be a lot of fun, leopard gecko. I think they have the really crazy Pad. fingers, don't they? Pads on their fingers. Oh, yeah. Okay, now let's draw his first finger. So we're going to draw another claw, or it looks like a C that comes out. And then back in, in to finish his hand. Okay, now he's got more fingers. So let's not draw... Not just two, he's not yeah. a Lego. Let's try, to draw, <laughs> let's try to draw a bunch more fingers in there. It's a lot like Frozone. You remember how we drew yeah. one arm in front and then the other arm back here? Looks just like that. So... It's the front of his hand, and you can just see this part, the first finger, and then his other fingers back here, like that. So let's repeat those same steps over here. We'll draw the thumb. We'll draw that backwards C that comes out for his front finger, back into his wrist, and then we'll add all those other fingers back here that are being overlapped. Oh, he looks so cool. All right, let's add the details on his arm. So I'm going to add two lines right here on his for his glove and then we can add some rectangles one up here and then one down on the back of his hand right there oh. and then let's add straps over here we're going to add straps almost just like his leg here so i'm going to add two, one two three and then let's add a little rectangle down here on his hand okay we're missing one last thing he's got a pouch a big pouch probably to carry uh What's the elixirs? Is it elixir? Oh. Or like it's... bombs? No. What's the one that makes you dance? I... Oh, disco. Oh, no, boogie bombs. Oh, boogie bombs. <laughs> Maybe that's where he keeps his boogie bombs. Yes. Okay. We, we got did. another donation. What? The greatest mine. <laughs> the great Minecraft is donating, uh, donated another 99 cents. Thank you so much. That's so cool. Thank you. All right, dude, we're done. Ex we're done drawing. Yes. But we still need to do one last thing. What Color is it? Him. Yeah. It's not really one last thing, it's a lot of last things, but yes. he's going to look so much better once we color him. So we hope our art friends are going to do the same thing. We're going to use colored pencils to color him. Oh, you know what? First thing we can do we is color coloring. in, yes, color in his face and also these little marks up here on his, on his uh, hood. So, okay, so I want to ask our art friends, okay, we drew, we drew Raven and I know a lot of our art friends love Minecraft. So what is the next one we should draw? It's either Ragnarok or... No, Minecraft. Sorry, did I say Minecraft? Yeah, you said Fortnite. That. Fortnite. A lot of our friends like Fortnite. Fortnite. Which skin should we draw next? Ragnarok or... Drift. Drift. Drift is the one you want to draw. Yeah. Huh? Okay. All right. So let's ask our art friends. They're going to vote. We got another let donation, us too. <laughs> oh, my. oh, my goodness. This is from Minecraft. Oh, he's donated so much. That's so awesome. All right. So we get. I'm going to... We're gonna draw. We're gonna color a little bit, and then I'm gonna come back to the chat, and we'll see how many people put drift or Ragnarok. Ragnarok looks cool. We would draw him all maxed out with his yeah. armor, with same the with skull, drift. and same with drift. Yeah, maxed out. All right. Okay. So, and then while we're coloring, I want to ask you too. Have you um, you've been playing with the new update? What's some of your favorite? And another one. No, this oh, one's God, from. <laughs> This is from uh, somebody else. This is from Olivia Pike. Please give me a shout out to Autumn from uh, Glau Gloucester, MA. Is that, is that right? Mass is it Massachusetts? Um, that's awesome. Thank you so much, Olivia, for the $1.99. We appreciate it. 
it means a lot to us. All of the donation means a lot. It's so much fun chatting with it, with uh, doing these live draw longs because we get to chat. Oh, look at these. Oh, I think, I think it's drift, dude. Look how many drifts there are. Oh wow. There's the Ragnarok. Bunch drift, of drifts. Drift, drift, drift. Is there a soccer, soccer skin? skin? There is. Does it look like it, a soccer player? Yeah. Well, it's like they have like the characters from the skins. But uh -huh. they put them in soccer uniforms. Oh. So, and then there's during like, the World Cup. Yeah, and then you could like change like USA like. Can you still do that? Uniforms. Um. Uh. Well, the shop changes. The shop changes, but can changing. you still do the soccer stuff? Uh yeah. Can I, I think it might it might be over. I don't think you can get it anymore until next year. Oh okay. Next World Cup. Okay, so with the update, dude, what's your favorite? I noticed I saw you playing golf the other day in Fortnite, and I was yeah. like, what? There's golf now. And there's a golfing course and like basketball courts. Yeah. Aren't you supposed to be busy like trying to t take over like yeah? Or but win? if you clean out a whole entire team. And well, there's nobody like, around no you. No one around you. Yeah, I, was, then you I play golf with my golf? friends. Is it, <laughs> is it like dancing? Yeah. Oh my! Just, my marker is almost yeah, dead. Mine. Is yours almost dead? I think mine might be good for a little bit though. This is how. This is why we go through them so fast. Yeah. So many drawings. <laughs> okay, we got the, a drift. Totally won. Drift is the next one that yeah. we're gonna do. Okay. Connor and River just donated a dollar. You know what's so cool, Connor and River. We, I love Connor and River. They all well. I love all of our art friends, but one of, Connor and River do every single one of our challenges, and I know that a bunch of our art friends do all of the challenges too. But I just I always notice their drawings. They always tag us, and they do such a good job. And you know what else is really cool about Connor and River? What? Their mama does the drawings too with them. They're That's awesome. awesome. Yeah, we love them so much. They're they're so they're such great artists. Thank you, Connor and River, for the dollar donation. You guys rock. All right. Okay. What else? What else is cool in the in the new update, dude? Uh, you like the golf carts? Yeah. All the golf carts are really cool. Yeah. Yeah. They have like the Der Burger and the Tomato Head like keychain. Yeah. Like hanging on like the. <laughs> so all the little details. You like noticing like the little yeah. details in the. And I like the story, how the golf carts, came, how the golf cart came, and like the drift. The came. backstory. The backstory. I don't know the backstory. Do we have time for the backstory? I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna use. Um, this seems too dark. This is too dark. Where do you have two grays? Did I, I lose one, one of my grays? Where'd my other gray go? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I don't have the darker gray. Oh, I thought we had two gray. <laughs> I'll just use this gray. That's all right. Which one is it? Is it this one? Yeah, I think it's that one. Oh, yes. First try. Yeah. All right. We got it. Okay. We're using, it's like a medium gray. They're cool. It's like a 70% cool gray. And we're using Prismacolor colored pencils. So if you guys have the same colors, you can, you can uh, match what we're doing. The reason why I wanted this specific gray is it's not too dark and it's not, it's not too, too light. Bright. It's, yeah. And it's in the middle. Yeah. It's in the middle. We didn't want a light gray and we didn't want it to look black. We wanted it to look gray. So. Uh, oh, and Olivia Pike donated again. It's pronounced, uh, we pronounced it wrong. We do that all the time. Gl Glosta, LOL, Autumn Ray. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm so, I'm the worst at pronouncing things. I can barely speak English. <laughs> oh, thank you so much, Olivia. Uh-oh. Melanie says, my sister has a crush on Jack. <laughs> the only reason why I said that is I knew it would turn your face red. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I think it's cute. Oh, okay, I'll stop. I'll stop. I'll stop. <laughs> well, you can say hi. Say hi to them. Hi. <laughs> What's your favorite drawing that you have done? What's your favorite drawing? That's from Nea. This, mm. We get this question a lot, but we, sometimes it changes. changes. Yeah. Probably right now, it might be the raven skin or the omega. Raven or omega? Yeah. How about that tiger that we just oh, drew? Oh, that though? tiger was really cool. That was fun, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. I think this Out one might be three. my new favorite one, too. 
I like how long his, his arms got really long. Yeah, I like arms. how wide mine is. Yeah, super wide. Looks like a football player. Yes. Rugby player. Uh, let's see. I'm try, let's try to answer some more of our art friends' questions and even give them some shout-outs. Oh, Ella Bain says, first time catching you live. And that is so exciting, Ella. Thank you for joining us live. We hope you're having a lot of fun. And, okay, so tell our art friends when we're going to do our next live lesson so that they can catch it next time, too. Uh, do you remember? 1 o'clock Wednesday. Yes. Wednesday. Yep. Tuesday. No. Monday. Monday Monday, this, Wednesday, and Friday. Yeah, this week we're going to do live lessons Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. At 1 o'clock. At 1 o'clock. Mountain one, Standard Time. 1 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. So be sure to check your time zone to make sure that you can adjust because it will be a different time if you're drawing, like, in Australia or drawing in New York, it's a different time. So be sure to check. Oh, someone wants us to draw Ronaldo. That'd be cool. Can you draw a fish or a penguin? Lucas Clark says, yes, I'm so excited. And Lil Green says, shout out. And somebody says they're drawing from India. That's so cool. Watching New York City, watching from New York City. And uh, someone asked if we could draw more Pusheen. Well, Pusheen. I love Pusheen. Pusheen. She's so cute. Pusheen. I love drawing. We gotta we gotta figure out a different one to draw. Like uh, draw her. We're drawing her eating stuff. We should draw her doing something. Oh, we should, have we done the mermaid version of her? Didn't we do that with Hadley? I think so. Maybe. Maybe. We should do like one of the versions. Oh, the, the Comstock family says, will you draw more Fortnite skins items? Also, can I have a shout out? Yes, we could draw more Fortnite skins. That's what we we're... We could do the mini shield, but that would be like a 10 second video. Mini shield? What is it? Is it's that just, the thing you drink? Yeah, it's just like a, it's a U with, it's just one of, do you know the, yeah, it's like, like, like a pipes. beaker. Yeah, all well, those like, side, test, tube. test tubes. Yeah. yeah. It's just one of those and it just has like blue liquid in it. Oh, that's awesome. That would be cool. Yeah. We could draw more items like that. I think that would be a lot of fun. Yeah. We could draw the chug jug. The chug that. jug. <laughs> a lot of people like that. Um, that. Ragnarok. We got a request for Ragnarok. Oh, a bunch of requests for Ragnarok. Amanda Hartz wants a shout out. Oh, Melanie says, my sister is crying so much right now. I hope I hope it's a good crying because I wasn't trying to make I wasn't try, I was trying to be nice I wasn't trying to be rude <laughs> I hope it's a good crying oh we love our art friends so much and I was just teasing you like how a dad how I always tease you <laughs> how most dads tease their kids <laughs> oh sorry sometimes I take it too far though uh, <laughs> doing do another llama. We should draw another llama. Llamas. Llamas. <laughs> draw a potato. Draw a realistic cat. Oh, it's so much fun. I love watching the chat just go flying. It just goes crazy. All right, I'm going to try to color a little bit. And then, um, okay, I'm going to ask you some more Fortnite questions while we're coloring. So yeah. sometimes when I ask you questions, it's a little easier for me to color. Uh, where's your favorite place to drop and why? Okay, that's... Am I giving away hard. a secret? Why? Or it doesn't have doesn't maybe That's a couple hard. places. Where do you what type of places do you like to drop? Do you like to drop where I it's like busy? Loot Lake. Loot Lake. Tilted. Tower. Is that Tilted, tilted Tower? Towers, um, retail row. Retail row. Uh, What's your favorite loadout? Probably just. Do you whatever. snipe? Do you snipe a lot, or just I whatever like, you get? I like doing uh, double SMGs. Double SMGs. Okay. So, Cool. All right. How are you? Almost done? Yes. <laughs> no. Kind of. I'm almost no, done with really. the gray. Not really. Yeah. Not really. I'm gonna try to go a little faster here, and then let's oh, ask. I really like what? parasite palms. Parasite. Well, That's say one of it again. the new ones. Parasite palms. Parasite palms. Yeah. It's. I. Probably now I've been dropping there. Have you figured out what the what that rocket was for? Oh, that rocket! It just like shot. Oh, it sh like broke it, the yeah, sky. Yeah, broke the sky. And then like it. Crossed worlds like our reality and their. Oh right, and, okay. I like remember you reality. said that. Yeah. That's how they got drift in like the golf carts. Oh, okay. Because the that's golf carts what you're went, talking about. A golf cart went through it, and 
drift, the drift guy went through it too. So it's like a bridge between realities? Yeah. Between the two? That's cool. Oh, I think I got it. I'm almost done with my gray. I'm kind of almost done. You're almost done? Oh, kind of. Okay, see if you can go a little faster and then we can switch switch colors. All right, I got to do his pouch right here. Oh, he looks awesome. You know what I'm going to do next? I'm going to do his eyes. His eyes are really cool. So I'm going to use this purple. It's called Process Red. It looks like a pink purple. And I'm going to go color over the black but I'm also going to put a little line inside on the white. See that? Yeah. So a little border. This is to try and make his eyes look like they're glowing. So I'm going to go around on the outside. I'm watching Alexander uh, Boldakov says I'm watching from Bulgaria and I love art. Please give me a shout out. Eva says I'm drawing from New Mexico. And Randy Porter says, again, I says, I draw these with my dad. That's so cool that your dad's drawing with us. I think it's awesome when parents are drawing with their kids because that's what we do. Yeah. Every time. <laughs> so if if your mom's sitting there and she's and she's cooking, you need to tell her cooking dinner. Or, or if your dad's like cooking dinner, <laughs> somebody, if your parents are right next to you and they're not drawing with you, you got to tell them, dad, mom. Come draw with me. Cause grandma, it's, grandpa. Or grandma or grandpa. Or if your uncle and or brother uncles. or sister or friend or somebody somebody's sitting right next to you and they're not drawing, tell them to come draw with you. It's always more fun to draw with friends. All right. Now, I'm going back over the, the wow. pink color. This is like my fifth time sharpening. That's okay. <laughs> <laughs> so I went back over with the white to blend and to make it look softer so it looks more like it's glowing around his eyes. Does that look cool? Yeah, it does. You like that look? Yes. I think it looks really cool. Super All right. cool. Okay, now I'm going to switch. Oh, the Berg says Texas. They're drawing from Texas. Oh, Kawaii Kitten says, my friends are drawing with me. That's awesome. My brother and sister are drawing with you guys. That's from Ruben Garcia. Oh, uh, Big Boss Studio is wondering if you got the battle pass for season yeah. five. Yeah, you you try to finish always finish all the challenges. Yeah, you try to finish the challenges and save up, didn't you? Like this time, you had to sell a few of your dance yeah, moves. Yeah, because I bought stuff with the V Bucks in the last battle pass. Yeah, that you didn't really want as much, or you didn't like, think I they were very cool. What did you sell? Power, that? I think. <laughs> oh, was that was heart, that heart that dance. Heart, whatever it was. Yeah, it was. Heart power. I forgot what it was. <laughs> you sold that one on the back? I really, I really wanted to keep that one. <laughs> but you really wanted the battle pass, too. Yeah, I'd rather want the battle pass than that. So. Yeah. So I try, to, I try to encourage you to use just your stuff inside the game to not spend extra money, right? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> but if, if you don't have enough, it's okay. We... Because you play it so much and you love it, we do support them. <laughs> They're making so much money. Yeah, they hit like over a billion. Oh, uh, yeah, I think they hit that a while ago. <laughs> a while ago. <laughs> oh, I switched. I clicked off of the live stream, so I got to... Let me click back. Hopefully, it's still going. There we go. Yeah. All right. So, I, I, I clicked off the page, so I lost the comments there for a second. Uh, looking at these raven raven is pretty cool that's from somebody my bro and sis from saint Ju oh let's see my bro and sis also draw with me every day and i'm drawing from saint george utah and can you please draw a hyena that'd be cool that would be way cool be awesome. and noah says drawing from canada hanging out with caitlin says can you draw a cartoon donut i think that's what they're saying and uh kate gum says they want us to draw roblox we haven't drawn Roblox. We've gotten a lot of requests for Roblox, but we haven't we haven't drawn them yet. Thought that would be fun. There's so many crazy characters on Roblox too. Yeah, it's kind of hard to crazy. yeah. It's kind of hard to pick which one to draw. There's so much customization. Okay, now I'm drawing. I'm also coloring his pants purple, and we colored his scarf purple. And let's see. I'm trying to, it's so hard to keep an eye on the comments. 
the same time we're coloring. Oh. <laughs> All right, let's see if we can bust through the coloring really quick, and then we'll answer a few more questions and comments. Are you thinking about the challenge that we're going to give yeah. our friends? So every time we do a live lesson, we try to also add a, a challenge at the end to uh, get you guys to finish your drawings by adding a background. Mine. Oh, yeah, sorry. There you go, buddy. <laughs> now I'm going to use brown to do the straps. I'm going to color brown over here on his that. arm straps and also his chest. And try and bust through this a little quicker. Um, now you guys don't have to color as fast. I'm going to try and get to the comments. So I'm going to color a little faster. Uh, so what else? What else is your favorite? Some of your favorite things that you like with the new, the new update? I like a lot of the skins. The skins, your favorite one is drift, but is well, there I another really, one that you like? I really like the red stripe. I think that's what it's called. Red stripe. Yeah, it's uh, like a biker. Oh, cool. It's like a biking helmet on. So like He's a, got a biker helmet. Uh, she. Oh, she. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah. Does she got? Does she level up too? What are you looking no. for? Oh, uh, white. White. You want it to blend? Yes. There you go. Okay. Now his feathers are really cool. I'm gonna start with this blue. Or it's red line. Red line. That sounds. That sounds right because yeah. that's a automotive thing. Okay. Uh, I'm using peacock blue, and I'm gonna start out here on the feather, on the end of the feather. I'm gonna press really hard, but then I'm gonna get lighter towards his body, like this. Cool. Yes. Then I'm going to go back over it with uh, the purple, the dark purple, and then I'm going to go the other direction. So I'm going to press really hard close to his body and then get lighter going the other way so that you can blend the two colors together. Look at that. You can do that on anything. That's a fun technique to fun. use on any drawing to blend two colors together. So I'm going to do that on all of the feathers. I'm going to go around like this and we'll start dark, press lighter as we get to his body. And I'm going to do all of them, just I'll go around and do blue on all of them first, and then we'll go back over them with the purple. I think they should add playground mode again so you can actually like play golf. Did you, you liked, oh yeah, so you can spend more time playing golf? Yeah. Because <laughs> there's like actual... Why like, did they get rid of playground? I well, thought because, a lot no, of, I just, thought a lot of people liked it though. Well, it's just they... They just have, swap it out? swap it out with different stuff. But they have 50 v 50, and 50 v 50 has been in there for like... A long time? A long time, which it's usually not been... But they usually, usually take that out? Yeah, they usually take it out, but it's only in, it's supposed to pretty much always been... I play, I play, I tried to play uh, Fortnite the other day, and <laughs> I got worked so hard. I, you're laughing. Thank you. I appreciate that. Now you're they welcome. know how bad it was. <laughs> but it really was. It was so bad. I, I usually am okay at those games, but not at that one. There's too many things to try and do. I got my low, I got like... I went around and looted a bunch of stuff. Lonely Lodge. You went to Lonely Lodge. I went to Lonely Lodge and I got all my stuff. I got the weapons and got the ammunition and got a bunch of whatever. And then I got shot. And then a uh, <laughs> wrestler came. That's a skin. Someone just came and took took me out like within... Two shots with a pump. Yeah. Pump. Well, I'm pretty sure it was because yeah. it hit you once. I was done. And then I just gave you back the controller. I was like, nah, I don't want to start over. <laughs> <laughs> That's the one thing I don't really like about the game is like, oh man, you can spend all this time like going around and you get the sweetest stuff and then you just get shot. And you're no done. Way. Yeah. And then it's game over. You got to start over. But I think that's why you get so excited when you actually win one, right? Yeah. All right, cool. What I'm missing some shading. I'm going to add a little bit of shading over here on his feathers and then I think we're done dude so I'm gonna start here this is a dark gray you could use black too it's a 90 percent I'm gonna start really dark next to his body and and put another layer on top of that purple just to add more 3d and to actually make him look look a little cooler or darker so add this little shadow okay we need to do a few more shout outs before we say goodbye to our art friends we hope you guys all had an awesome weekend too and had a lot of fun drawing Hopefully you guys draw with us on the weekend. We, we don't do any lessons over the weekend, but you can catch up on some of the lessons that you might have missed. All right, let's do some shout outs. <laughs> I got to scroll down to the bottom. Oh, here we go. 
Charlotte Bar- Bramwell says, "Are you still? Co- oh yeah, you, sorry, you sorry. keep coloring. Yeah, I you keep coloring, and I'll do the shout. <laughs> I'll do okay. the shout since I'm further along." Oh yeah. And I missed it. Where did it go? I was gonna give someone a shout, and I lost it. We're uh, so sorry. I'm sorry. Kim Heller, what is your favorite restaurant, and how many wins do you have? I have. I think now I have almost fifty. You have, have think, almost fifty wins. I think fifty-one actually. Where's your? What's your favorite restaurant, Jack? Hmm. There's a place here locally. It's not a chain or anything, but it's called Miranchito. Oh yeah, Miranchito. It's that a place Mexican is so restaurant. Good. It's so good. That's one of our favorite places, huh? Yes. I had yes. to help you out because. And because there's so much. There's so many so good, places good places we like to go. There's also a, a sushi place. You love Tsunami. sushi, don't you? Tsunami, yeah. That place is... Sushi. We love sushi, don't we? Yeah. So I'm adding some shading on his body underneath his scarf right here and also on the side of his body to make him look more 3D. Draw a knight on a, on a hamburger. <laughs> it's from Jonathan Lindstrom. Look, he did, <laughs> that that hamburger emoji he wants us to draw a knight on it. <laughs> Oh, uh, Kitslam gave us a suggestion. Uh, maybe Hubs, Miss, maybe the Hubs could draw a cute cell phone. I think he probably meant Mrs. Hubs. That would be a great idea. Ah, oh, draw Bob Ross. <laughs> <laughs> Turtle Lover wants a shout out. We have a shout out from Charlotte. That's from Charlotte Bramwell. I think that was the person I forgot. All right. <laughs> shout out watching from Tennessee. That's from Gar. Uh, I don't know how to pronounce Graciel. I sorry, I can't pronounce that one. <laughs> the dab police. Hi, remember me? Yes, I think I do remember the dab police. I do remember the dab police. <laughs> Someone said draw Jack. Draw Jack. We have drawn. Yeah, we've drawn our whole family. Actually, you can check that out on our channel. Lily Murphy says, I'm from New Zealand, and the time is 7.41 a.m. in the morning. Oh, wow. Wow, they're up early drawing with us. Right now it's 1.43. Okay, Rafi, Rafi, Rafi Malik says, draw the whole Hubs family. And we have. Yeah. They must have missed it. So you can go over to our channel at youtube.com slash artforkidshub and then uh, do a search for any of us. You could draw, uh, do a search for Rob, Jack, Mrs. Hubs. Austin, Austin, Hadley, Hadley, Olivia, and Olivia, and it will pop up. It'll, it'll, you'll be able to find our those lessons of our whole family. <laughs> Turtle Leather says, "Thank you for the shout out." And there's another. Shout oh, out. what? And there's another shout out. Yeah. <laughs> Isabel Hunter says, "Draw Lilo and Stitch." Uh, what's up from Stock? Oh, Connor River live in Stockton, California. No way. I didn't know that. That's cool. We, um, my grandma, uh, when she was alive, she lived in Stockton, California. And we'd actually go there to visit all the time. That was one of my favorite things to do when I was a kid. She had a swimming pool. And we'd go swimming all summer long in Stockton, California. I love that place. That's cool that they're from there. Do you have that black? So cr- someone asked, what are black? those colors called? Um, what? What do you want? Black. Oh, gray. black instead of this dark gray? Or dark dark gray. You want to try the dark gray? I don't know if I have another one. Oh, yep. I do. Here you go. Okay, so uh, we get a lot of questions about our colored pencils. You want to tell them? You tell them this time. Prismacolor. Prismacolor color, color pencils. And where can they buy them? Um, Amazon. Amazon, yes. And we have links below this video where you can go over to Amazon and purchase the exact same ones. We love them because they're so smooth, they're soft. The lead is really soft, and so they're fun to blend with and color with. Okay, dude, I'm done. Are you done? Almost. I'm really let me close. sweep your let me sweep your paper. Oh, wow, it looks so cool. You know what? I'm going to go around really quick. And I I'm going to do, do that a, too. No. <laughs> you don't have to. Just finish coloring. Ah! Okay. <laughs> You know what? I'm not even gonna go around the whole thing. I don't think I'm just gonna go around right, right to here. I'm just gonna do it on the top of his head. I like doing this. I like going around the outside just because I think it makes it. It's a cool style and gives it a nice look. To add a little thicker line around the outside. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave it like that. <laughs> 
All right, a few more shout outs and then we're going to say goodbye. You got the challenge? You yes. know what the challenge is going to be? Okay, I, I, Aja K says, can I have a shout out? And Anam Niam says, Jack Drine is so cool, is so cute, and you must achieve A in arts. Keep it up, Jack. And <laughs> <laughs> someone requested, okay, drop verses from Roblox. So we'll have to check out what verses is. You know what? When I when I went off of the do when I went off the page, the donations went away. That's too bad. We'll have to. I'll have to see if I can find them later. Can you draw Thanos? Please draw Drift. And Emma says, "Can you give me a shout out, please?" Yes, and shout out. yeah, <laughs> Bryce Smith also wants a shout out. And Lil Green says, "Draw Sonic the Hedgehog." Draw, ooh, Kitslam wants a realistic planet Earth. That would be way cool. We have a cartoon planet Earth. Oh, and Eric and Elizabeth says, Pratt there says they're from Utah. That's way cool. Okay, you done, man? Yes. Okay, one more sweep, and let's give them the challenge, okay? Oh, Three. let's check it out. We got to look at these one last time. Oh, my goodness. Look at that. It looks so cool, man. I love your drawing, and it looks so aw I love how white it is. And that's okay that you came down here close to the edge of the paper. Yeah. Because it looks so much better when you fill the paper. When you draw things bigger on your page, it always looks awesome. Yes. Now, it's okay that they look different, right? Remind our art friends it's okay if their drawings look different. Because yeah. what's... The, the most important thing is to have fun. Yes, to have fun and to, to practice. practice. We hope you guys had a lot of fun following along with us. But what time is it? Challenge time. It's challenge time. We need to challenge our art friends. What is it? There's not very much room left. To draw them in Haunted Hills. Haunted Hills. What is Haunted Hills? It's like a giant, like, abandoned, like, castle. It's a big... Well, is it a, spooky? There's, yeah. It's, it's yeah. kind of spooky? It's... Yeah. <laughs> and it's a castle. Yes. And we got a donation just for it. Oh. <laughs> I'm glad you know. <laughs> oh, it's from the Vlogging Universe. Thank you so much for the donation. That's awesome. Okay, so the challenge is to draw a haunted castle in the background, something yes. spooky because he's kind of spooky, huh? Yeah. And then when you're all done, ask your parents to take a photo and post it to Instagram so that we can see what it looks like and also to share it with all of our other art friends. And then what are the two tags? If, uh, at at Art for Kids Hub. Yes. And hashtag. hashtag AFKH challenge. Yeah, so the first one lets us know that you posted, and the second one keeps it together so it's easy to find. It also makes it easy for other art friends to find them too. And I want to encourage all of our parents to go around and check out some of our other art friends and leave comments and also like their photos too, because that would make everybody's day, wouldn't it? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> all right, we hope you guys had a lot of fun following along with us, and we'll see you later, art friends. Goodbye. Goodbye.